Former governor of Anambra State and a 2023 presidential aspirant, Peter Obi, has responded to the governor of River State, Nason Wiki, who questioned his integrity after he decided to leave the People's Democratic Party, PDP. Peter Obi had on Wednesday said recent developments within the PDP made it practically impossible for him to continue participating and making constructive contributions. He resigned from the main opposition party and later joined the Labour Party. But Wiki told Channels Television that the former Anambra state governor lacks integrity and that he left PDP because he knew he would not win the presidential ticket. Appearing on Channels Television on Friday evening, Obi was asked to respond to the claims put forward by Wiki and the former vice presidential candidate said, Wiki mentioned the issue of integrity. He said that my living questioned my integrity. I don't know how that one came about. But I think when you talk about integrity, you talk about the management of public resources. That is what we should be talking about in this country. And when such things are mentioned about me, I feel something is missing somehow. Go and check my record as a governor. I was impeached for three reasons. One, my office was approved to be renovated for 298 million naira, but I renovated everything with 43.3 million naira. Two, my lodge was approved to be renovated for 486 million naira, but I did everything with 81 million naira. The number three item was that I was saving money without the authority of the house. From my day one in office, we started saving money and went through the eight years that I was governor. Go and ask any contractor that served with me to talk about what I'm entitled to, inflated any contract, any supplier, anybody. And when I left office, I left behind $500 million at that time because it was public money. I was managing public trust. So for me, when you talk about integrity, it questions your management of public trust and resources. Go to Anambra today. I have no land given to me by the state government. My managing director of my housing authority, Mike Wanfo, gave me land and two houses and I told him I'm not entitled to it. Nobody has ever seen me in my political life sharing money, Obi said. I knew uh, um, Peter Obi was going to come for Nays on Wiki. You know, after he left the People's Democratic Party, after Peter Obi resigned and dropped his uh, presidential ambition under the platform of the People's Democratic Party, Wiki came for him that uh, this man lacks integrity and that Obi knew that he wasn't going to win. He couldn't stand the chances. He couldn't stand um, those people who are contesting, the likes of Atiku Abubakar, himself, uh, Naysom Wike, Bukola Saraki, Bala Mohammed, uh, that all of these persons under the platform of the People's Democratic Party, that Peter Obi doesn't have what it takes to win election, that ever since he left being governor of Anambra State, that which other election has he won? Even to win Senate, he's not been able to win any, that um, the man lacks integrity. Now, uh, Peter Obi was an, on an interview with China's television just yesterday on Friday, and trust uh, um, channels televisions uh, presenter they reminded him they brought this before him that um, what's your reaction to what um, Naysom Wiki said all of the claims Naysom Wiki made about you and the man was very relaxed to be honest Peter Obi was very relaxed and he said um, you know what if we're talking about integrity that to him except um, uh, he's going to be corrected on this but to him he believes that uh, when you talk about integrity in this contest in politics, he's talking about uh, uh, the management of resources, not just resources, public resources. He's talking about how you manage it. That's when uh, integrity comes into play. That, okay, if we already know um, the context of integrity, then let's go back to his administration when he was governor of Anambra State. That's the only three times he was impeached. <laughs> the reason is so interesting. And you know, when you talk about being impeached, everyone, the, everyone's ear uh, was just standing out to hear what he would say. But he was impeached three times. And on the three occasions, it was actually because what the budget approved or the budget was approved for, he used even less, less than that. And most probably they are trying to find out how that was possible. And um, 
even maybe those who approved the budget, they were trying to get something out of it, but he refused and presented exactly the exact figures that was used. And if you see the, the massive gap between these figures for the renovation of his, um, of his office, 298 million one would think that okay even if you want to cut it down reduce cost it might just go to maybe 200 million or 250 he did it below 50 million naira, saving um the government about um, 100 and not 100 250 million saving the government about 250 because he used just 43 you can imagine that the next one was uh four 486 million naira, which was meant to um, renovate his lodge. See, again, he saved about 300 million naira. And all of these monies, if he had spent all of them, only God knows what would have uh, been of an Anambra state at the moment. But we know the case with um, politicians and former governors, they tend to attack themselves. If you ask uh, Willie Obiano, who was the immediate um, governor of an Anambra state, you know he will not he won't say anything well about uh, peter Obi. that's how they always attack themselves and um, uh, uh, lay propagandas and all of that politics is a game of interest but anyways uh, uh peter Obi actually was governor in that state under the platform of abga he left there to the people's democratic party who knows maybe that is why uh, William Obiano made all of those remarks or if it's actually true that Peter Obi did not do anything in that state. But back to Naysom Wiki, uh, Peter Obi did not, he didn't drag Naysom Wiki, did not say anything. He only just put some details forward, left some informations with the public and let them do the maths. Let them do the statistics and then find out who is the person of um, integrity here. If we're talking about integrity, let's know who has integrity and who doesn't have integrity. That was what Peter Obi did here. That even up to land, sharing of land, that he refused to take any government land. That why will he take a government land? Why? On what basis? He refused. So, uh, <laughs> well, he has given the response. You know, everyone was waiting for this response from Peter Obi. Peter Obi is now with the Labour Party. He resigned from the People's Democratic Party and he said that the way things are going in that party, he cannot see. It's impossible. The way he put it was that he was, it was practically impossible for him to uh, uh, make any constructive contribution through that party that he should not be uh, misunderstood he's still going to make constructive contribution but from a different platform from a different party which he already belongs to right now well guys um this is the response to nice and wiki leave us your take guys thank you once again for staying tuned please don't forget to like share and to subscribe till i come your way again with more updates bye